Okay, so welcome to Hamburg. Jorge Gutierrez. This is why this is Gutierrez. Jorge Gutierrez. Gutierrez. Yeah, yeah. So Jorge, what's your first impression of the city you know you here since Tuesday evening? Uh, it is a beautiful city. I wasn't expecting to be as, as big as it is, but uh, for what I've seen, it's, it's a beautiful city. You seem to be like a big deal in Mexico. When we released the news on Monday in the morning, uh -huh. like how, how many hours you're back in Mexico? Six or seven? Eight. Eight. <laughs> Eight hours later, I got the notification on Twitter. So when the people in Mexico were waking up, it was like <laughs> all the Twitter notifications from Mexican journalists, Mexican basketball fans, Mexican basketball pages. They all retweeted our news release were commenting, following us on Twitter, asking for pictures, asking for information. You have your own PR girl. She wrote me on Instagram that uh, she's doing the PR work of you. So you have a lot of fans in Mexico. How, how big of a deal you are back home? I, I don't really know. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't know. I, I'm not a big social media guy. Uh, but, you know, I like to represent my country. Uh, you know, that's, that's what I love to do and that's what I'm here for. And represent my country in the right way and try to help the team win. Now we need to help the Hamburg Towers win. When you're adding you, I had a tough time to know what to make out of you. What are you able to bring to the table for our team? Experience, I think. You know, I have uh, played around the world. I have a pretty good uh, lease and then I think a little bit of experience will help the team. Last season you played in Mexico, or even this season, the Mexican Champions League. How can you compare the Mexican Champions League to the German BBL? Uh, you know, to be honest, I, I haven't seen much of the, of the German League. I would like to you if I say something about it. But uh, you know, I've heard it's a pretty competitive league and it's an upcoming league. So uh, I'm just you know excited to start. I started last night practice. I think practice went well. Uh, but I'm just here to 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 help the team. You know, help them continue to get better and try to get some wins. From our team you already knew Bo Beach in advance, you played with him in the practice camp for the Brooklyn Nets and our Dutch guy Jana Fravio played with him in Trento in Italy, went to the finals. What did they tell you about the league and our team? Uh, same thing as coach told me, you know, it's a competitive league and a, a league and then a team, a city that, that is very fun to play at. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's a good set of uh, group of guys, uh, fun guys to be around, uh, you know, that's, that's, that's what I want, you know, for a professional guy like me, I want to be in a good city and in a comfortable spot where I can get back. On the internet I read you uh, enjoy drawing in your free time, that's right? Yeah, I mean, besides sleeping, trying to sleep, <laughs> trying to rest, uh, you know, getting to know the city a little bit, go out eat and stuff like that, uh, in the downtown I like to drive so. So as an artist, uh, draw, how are you going to make the Hamburg Towers your personal Mona Lisa? <laughs> uh, you know, it's just try to play hard, uh, try to uh, communicate at all times and try to connect with Coach a little more. So uh, that's it. I'm not a superhero, uh, I'm not like a crazy type of player, I'm just a regular player that plays hard and likes to win. Okay, muchas gracias. <laughs> hey, Coach, how are you? said that he's trying to connect with you. How are you connected with him already? Uh, great. We're really happy Jorge is here. Uh, we've asked him to, to be who he is. Uh, who Jorge is is enough. Uh, he's such a such an experienced player. Uh, you know, I, I'm very familiar with Jorge from coaching against him in the D-League. And I have so much respect for what he's arrived, you know, achieved in his career, uh, his style of play. You know, he made a fantastic first impression last night in practice. Um, the playmaking, the passing, making his teammates better. Uh, so I'm really thankful that he's here and really excited uh, to work with Jorge uh, and integrate him into our team this year. What is the role you have for him on the team, on the court and also off the court? Well, we love uh, the fact that he's a two-way player. He plays both ends of the floor, offensively, defensively. He makes his teammates better. Uh, he's he's a very experienced point guard, very experienced playmaker. So, you know, you could see the the immediate ball movement in our passing. Uh, he's a really crafty 
pick and roll playmaker. Uh, so again, we're just asking Jorge to be himself, be who he is, and we believe in that. And we're really excited about uh, adding him to our team. I think he'll make his teammates better. Uh, he'll execute our system. Uh, he'll really compete. Uh, and these are all the things that, that we're looking for um, with, with his addition here. You coached against him in the G League. Yeah. I guess back then it was they called the D League, right? Yeah. He played for the Canton Charge. Yeah. And he brings some challenges for opposing, opposing coaches. What kind of challenge can the opposing coaches in the BBL expect? Uh, he's just a, a, a really smart, competitive, well-rounded player. Uh, I think he plays to win every single game. Um, you know, he's not going to back down from a challenge. He's, he's a physical, um, you know, competitive defender. Uh, and, and he's a smart player. So he's a guy that, that knows how to win. Um, You know, and, and I think back to a lot of those matchups back in the D League where, where our guards struggled with his physicality and, you know, uh, he does a lot of, a lot of things to help his team win on the court and, and that's what our fans can expect here uh, in Hamburg as well. Like the last one, you're teasing to one always with Canada jokes. Do you have some Mexican jokes as well? <laughs> Not yet. I'm, I'm working on my, my Mexican jokes, you know, but uh, we've got quite an international roster here. You know, uh, uh, Germany, USA, Canada, Netherlands, and now Mexico. Austria. Austria. No, let me forget that. Thank you, Rupert. Uh, but I really have enjoyed getting to know uh, Jorge over the last few days. Uh, I respect him so much as a player and, and what he's done. And really, I'm looking forward to, to more time with him. And, And uh, hopefully at some point I can come up with some good, you know, Mexican jokes for entertainment. <laughs> I hope so too. Okay, dann gehen wir es jetzt an das umfangreiche Journalistenschar hier ab. Können wir euch hier loslegen? Ja. Kochen. Kochen. Okay. Um, uh, you, what was your special motivation to join the Hamburg Towers? You played playoffs and... Uh, You used to play playoffs, and what was your motivation to join a club who tries to avoid a relegation? Uh, you know, I love playing basketball. Uh, you know, and, and I, I think uh, having the opportunity to play here in Hamburg, it's, it's a good opportunity for me. I've heard it's a good league. I heard it's a tough league, uh, and a competitive league. Which, uh, as a competitor, that's what I want to be. I want to compete against the best. What do you know until now uh, about the Hamburg Towers? Uh, have you seen them playing? Or? Uh, you know, I, pr I just got here, uh, but I practiced with them last night. Uh, and, uh, you know, it's, it's a young team, uh, but a tough team. You know, they, they wanna, they're, they're hungry to learn, uh, which is a good thing. For me, it's a good thing because I'm coming in with experience, and I'm hoping uh, I could help them. Okay. Um, What do you think what are the facts to help the towers that help the towers mostly to uh, to to win the next uh, matches? Um, you know, like I say, I just practice once with them. Uh, I think we just need to get better, uh, uh, talk more, uh, be have more communications, stuff like that. Just the simple stuff of a basketball game, you know. But uh, like I say, I just got here. Uh, Hopefully, whatever I, I can do to help the team will help the team win next next matches. Uh, you mean you it's, you will, you want to be a leader for them for the for the young team? Bo Beach and Yannick Franke know you from different places. Uh, yeah, yeah. And do yeah. you know them too? Yeah, yeah. I played with Yannick in Italy. Okay. Uh, I think that was two years ago. Okay. Uh, we had a we had a pretty good run in Italy. Went to the finals in Italy. Unfortunately, we lost. But I did spend the whole year with Yana, uh, and with Bo, uh, I did some. Uh, I did preseason with the Nets with Bo when we were both in, in back in New York. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, you just learned how to greet in Hamburg. <laughs> I'm sorry. You, you just learned how to greet in Hamburg. So say. I honestly just uh, forgot. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> so It's, say uh, say. Moin Moin Hamburg for for you for the fans. Ah, moin Moin Hamburg. Yes, yeah. Moin Moin Hamburg. Moin Moin Hamburg. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Yeah.